Hey everybody, it's Ped's Card Collection coming back at you with another video and today we are going to be recapping my most recent baseball card store pickups as well as showing off some recent trades and some mail from some subscribers. So going to get into that on tonight's video. So let's just get right into it guys. Hope you're all doing well. Really appreciate you checking this video out today. Uh, once again, we're going live this Saturday evening, probably around 8 or 9 Eastern Time p.m. Doing a giveaway card sale, bunch of fun, and uh, going to be on for a while. But uh, I thought we would get one more video in before that. So these cards I'm showing right now are uh, some cards I picked up from this past weekend at the card store. So I went twice, actually. Um, I believe I went twice. Maybe that was, yeah, no, I went twice for the Gypsy Queen. So this was the second time around. Um, so I picked up this nice Fernando Tatis Jr. Rookie game used relic. So I thought that was a pretty cool card. Uh, bought quite a number of Tatis cards. Thought it was a good time to buy while he's still, you know, out. Um, he's going to be coming back soon and still a super young, exciting player. So Tried to take advantage of his cheap prices right now and picked up a whole bunch of Tatis cards. So I got this Jersey rookie card of Tatis. Then we got the cloth variation from Topps Heritage rookie card of Tatis. Sick card there. Didn't have any of those cloth cards in the collection. Then we picked up this Tatis. This is a blue border. 150 year greatest player insert rookie. I think these were from 2019 tops update. So really cool card there The blue variation not number, but it is Shorter printed then we got the nice 2019 tops chrome update pink refractor Tatis rookie card really sharp card there Didn't open too many value packs of update, but I did open quite a number of uh, the regular chrome so I have uh, two or three of the base or of the chrome, regular chrome, pink refractors. Just didn't have any of the rookie debuts. Then we got us a couple of Luis Roberts. So we got the nice Bowman Sterling rookie card. We got the unparalleled rookie from Panini Chronicles. Picked up this nice Bobby Witt Jr. Bowman Sterling card. Figured why not? Why not roll the dice on Nick Neidert? This is a Topps Chrome sapphire orange refractor rookie card numbered out of 25 so pretty sharp looking card there number one out of 25 pretty cool and we got this sick joey bart rookie card the 2010 tops chrome design reminiscent of the 2010 tops chrome buster posey iconic rookie card so bart is the predecessor and um I just had to pick up this card. It reminded me so, so dearly to 2010 Buster Posey rookie card and uh, picked it up immediately just on eye peel. So just a great looking card. I remember opening up a hobby box of 2010 Topps Chrome as a kid with my, uh, my best friend and I got absolutely hosed on the box. I got a redemption but of like Corey Gillespie or uh, Brian Matus or somebody. But I did get some really nice rookie cards, Stanton rookie cards, Strasburg Refractor, and this reminded me of that. So I would like to get one more, one or two more boxes of 2010 Topps Chrome to rip on the channel. I think that would be a fun little throwback Thursday, if you even call that a throwback. Yeah, 12 years, I'd say that's a throwback. But still pretty modern, where you can get some pretty hot rookies like Mike Stanton, now known as Giancarlo Stanton. So... Uh, also got the Adinzo Reyes, first Bowman Aqua 499. You can get rookie cards too of Steven Strasburg. Um, I think Donaldson might be an update, but correct me if I'm wrong. And uh, Carlos Santana. There's, and there's a couple other pretty solid ones. So, But let's get into these. I got picked up all these cards from the store on Friday. Most of these were in the dollar box, so I got a really good deal on these. We're just gonna show them one by one, like we just did. So I picked up this pretty cool David Price 2009 Tops rookie card. Can't believe I didn't have this in the collection. The nice flagship true rookie of David Price, Vanderbilt alum. We got the uh, Bowman Chrome CC Sabathia. I believe this is his rookie card, so if not, it's like a second year card, so a pretty sharp card there. Bowman Chrome. It's a little bit bowed, but nothing like 
nothing a uh, bowed top loader can't fix. So you put one top loader that's bowed this way, like that, put it in, and they just counteract each other. It's a little trick I've been doing for a while now. Uh, if I can show you guys. So like this, this one isn't as bad, but it kind of tilts up. So I would put the card in this way and it kind of counteracts the card and it goes, it ends up straight. So uh, you got to get creative some ways. I just have OCD. If I, I don't like using you know, curved top loaders unless I use it on to counteract a curved card. But, uh, you know, I'm a little bit too, too picky about that stuff. I got to relax. So next up, we got a nice... 2009 Bowman Chrome rookie card of Andrew McCutcheon. I think this is 2009. Yep, so a nice Bowman Chrome rookie card of Andrew McCutcheon. Kutch, now with the Brewers. It's a really cool card there. Then we got ourselves a Future Stars Adrian Beltre top stadium club rookie. Really nice card there. Over 3,000 hits. Got, the, got a run of Nolan Ryan cards mostly from the 80s. Sorry, we already showed that, but uh, we got the nice Nolan Ryan, 83 tops. We got the 82 tops highlights, Nolan Ryan. Then we got us the 84 OPG, Canadian print run. Then we got the normal tops, 84, Nolan Ryan. We got the Leaf, Donruss, Nolan Ryan from 85, Donruss, Leaf. Then we got the regular Donruss, 85. Nolan Ryan, we got the 1985 Tops. Nolan Ryan, we got the 86 Tops. Nolan Ryan, we got two of those bad boys. Then I got a couple nice 1970 cards. We got the Harmon Killebrew. This is an original Harmon Killebrew in the 500 Home Run Club Hall of Famer. And another guy in the home 500 Home Run Club, I believe, is Willie McCovey. Also a Hall of Famer. So a nice original Willie McCovey there. Picked up a Ken Griffey Jr. 1990 Tops Gold Cup card. Once again, most of these were in the dollar box, so I said, why the heck not? We got the Don Elston. This one's creased pretty badly, but it's a true 1960 original card. We got the 85 Tops Dwight Gooden. Even found this Kyrie Irving card in there. I think this is his rookie card, so don't collect too much basketball, but when I do find one that's a good deal, pick it up like this one. So this is a 2012 Panini Prism Kyrie Irving rookie card. Next up, we got a um, 2013 Tops. This is like the uh, the old classic vintage tall boy basketball design from like 1969 to 1971. I believe the years of basketball where they had the Lou Alcindor rookie card. Uh, Pete Maravich rookie card that were obviously this blown up and more of a uh, this is a smaller proportion but it's the same it's the same you know tall boy type style so nice Mike Trout 2013 little insert there we got the new age performers I think that's from 2015 picked up this cool Nolan Arenado relic card with the pinstripe we got a bunch of these Jack Flaherty cards this one's the Cracked Ice Atomic to 150. Rookie of the Year favorites. We got the regular Rookie of the Year favorites. We got some Tops Chrome Refractors. This one is the um, this one is the Prism Refractor. So pretty sharp looking card there. Hopefully he can come back. I think forget exactly what's uh, bothering him, but he has some kind of injury. So hoping he gets back sooner than later. And then we got the regular Refractor. Also from 2018, Tops Chrome. So sharp card there. And we got a whole bunch of the base cards. We got like one, two, three, and four. Then we picked up my boy Andrew Vaughn. This is from the hot box of 2021 Tops Heritage High Number. So the purple refractor there, that's 72 Tops design. We got Logan Gilbert. This is the Silver Pack Mojo rookie card. Got a Ryan Mountcastle rookie. Little Walker Bueller Alex Verdugo dual rookie card there from 2018 Tops Heritage. Got the Blake Snell from Top Stadium Club. We got a couple uh, 2016 Tops Blake Snell. I think this is series Whoa, update. Update. Okay. I've been updated. It is update. So we got a couple of those Snell rookie cards. We got the Dylan Cease and Desist 
Optic Refractor, the Rookies insert. We got the Mize Ice Rookie from Platinum, Ian Anderson. We got Jimenez, Sam Huff, Mad Bum from Upper Deck. Why not throw in a 1999 Tops Venusaur? Little Pokemon card throwback to my childhood. Still pick up uh, vintage Pokemon when I can for a good deal. I used to open, get these at the uh, convenience store when I was a kid and rip these packs open. I still have a bunch in my collection, so I picked up this nice Venusaur. We got the 2015 Topps Chrome, Jacob deGrom, second year card. We got a finest black refractor of Maglio Ordonez to 99. We got a 2017 Topps Chrome refractor of U Darvish. So a whole bunch of really cool cards. And uh, next up, I'm going to be showing, we're done with the card store pickup so I'm going to be showing some mail that I got some trades uh, some racks and uh, everything in between so let's start us off I got a really nice note from my subscriber Stephen Cohn who was kind enough to send me this beautiful Topps Holiday Pete Alonzo relic card so player worn memorabilia in the snowman we got a patch or a little swatch from his jersey of the royal blue. So didn't have this one. Thanks so much, Steven. Really appreciate it, man. And uh, didn't have to do that. Also sent another really nice note. Uh, going to keep that personal. And uh, we we also, he also was kind enough to send the Sweet Top Stadium Club master photos of Jacob DeGrom. Looks like he's in spring training. You can tell by all the fans behind the uh, wired fence and the orange um top of the fence so really appreciate that steven thank you again for that brother next up we made a trade with uh andrew lethbridge so got some really nice new jazz cards for the pc so starting us off we got the 2021 bowman's best this is the lava refractor rookie card and this one is the future vibrance numbered out of 50 so 46 out of 50 really sharp looking card there also traded for the Jazz Chisholm Bowman's Best Atomic Refractor. Just a beautiful card overall there. So uh, definitely revamped up the Jazz Chisholm collection with, and I got some more coming. Don't go anywhere just yet with this, these most recent pickups. So just a beautiful card. We got this beautiful Topps Inception Shane Boz Rookie On Card Auto, number out of 299. So unfortunately, he's on the 60 day injured list he's got some kind of elbow uh thingamajig going on so hopefully he can flush that out flush that down the toilet and pop on a new elbow and they'll be better than fresh as new so just go to the elbow store go say hey can i get an indestructible elbow and slap that puppy on as soon as possible i wish it were that easy because i i had a lot of elbow pr problems as well and i know how frustrating that can be man so just sending him, uh, hopefully he can have a speedy recovery, but just a sick, nasty card. Then he also threw in uh, some really nice ones. A Gavin Lux Mojo rookie card. He threw in this PC Mets Ray Wave card and a nice Joey Bart rookie card. I think this is the Topps Complete Set variation. So nice little trade there. Then two more guys. This next one up, I put some of these cards already away, but this is a trade I made with Fitzy. Sports cards, big Yankees fan. And uh, the card that I put away, I put a couple of cards away that I can't find, but it was a Frankie Lindor 2021 Tops short print, which was so sick. And then he traded me also these two really nice Jazz Chisholm rookie cards. This is from Panini Chronicles. This is the Elite Extra Edition variation number out of 99. So pretty sharp looking card there. Love Panini Chronicles. Hit me right in the PC. And then this is probably my favorite one. Did not see this coming. He said it was a surprise, and it surprised the absolute bejesus out of me. On a zero to bejesus, he scared the literal bejesus out of me. And I have yet to go recollect that bejesus. So we got the 2021 Panini Mosaic Blue Disco Team Color Match Jazz Chisholm Rookie Blue Refractor number to 85, guys. So just a marvelous card. Simply a work of art. Absolutely love Mosaic. And uh, 
just a sick card. So thanks, Fitzy. And once again, he sent me a bunch of other stuff too. I'm sorry, I just can't place it at the time. And then this last stack of cards isn't everything he sent, but Austin Farmer sent me a massive uh, rack, massive care package, and uh, sent me some awesome autos. I helped sell some stuff, and he was just being, you know, generous. He, you know, uh, narrowed down his PC and thought, you know, he uh, he sent these for the collection. So I really appreciate it, Austin. We got ourselves a Ryan Zimmerman Gaudi repr reprint on-card auto. So this is a 2007 Gaudi, Topps Gaudi. Ryan Zimmerman's second-year auto was an absolute menace with the Nationals. And how about this card? This is sick. He sent over a Topps, was his Topps Tribute? I think this is Topps Tribute. It's one of those releases or Immaculate or some crazy high-end product. Starling Marte on card auto numbered out of 50, guys. So that's just a nasty looking card for the PC. How about a Jose Reyes Prospects Auto? He was like my idol as a kid from 2003 Bowman. Jose Reyes Prospect on card auto. And I actually... Got his auto and David Wright's on a baseball to game once. And a couple of years later, my dog got a hold of that baseball and chewed it to pieces. And uh, I felt like my life was over. I was, you know, I was probably a teenager. I was crying and just, I couldn't believe it. But, you know, looking back, just a silly mistake. So, learned a valuable lesson, though. Keep your signed memorabilia or valuable collectibles away from pets. Same with your dinner. Um, but we got the nice, he sent over Trey Mancini rookie auto. Uh, Drew Romo, first Bowman Chrome Refractor Auto. He sent a bunch of TTM cards to him, and he inscribed this one, 2020 first-round pick, Drew Romo. So just a beautiful-looking card. Another inscribed Drew Romo Auto. Uh, this is the Elite Extra Drew Romo Auto to 205, and he's absolutely killing it this year, batting over 300. And high A alongside Zach Veen, two big prospects for the Colorado Rockies, who ever so dearly need that help. And then the LSU standout, Dylan Cruz, future first round draft pick. Could be, I believe he's draft eligible this year, so he's so he should be like a top 10 overall pick. Numbered out of 499 on-card black prospect auto. Just a sick card, has gap-to-gap -gap power, lightning fast speed. You know, just an all-around athlete and uh, sick card, Dylan Cruz. How about a Daryl Strawberry, Topps Gold Label Auto, framed auto to 75. Got a Mark Hanna, nice new addition to the Metsies from Topps Finest. It's a sick card there. We got a Brock Burke, rookie auto from Chronicles on card. This is Origins. Getting to the last couple cards here. We got Anthony K. Topps Chrome Refractor Rookie Auto. Number out of 499. We got the John Matlack 1976 Tops. TTM. That's a that just pops really nicely. He's got a nice signature, nice neat, and right on the be the beautiful part of the card. So that one's really cool. Gotta show that's my dad. Uh, and we got the 1978 tops, nailed it. Uh, this is the another John Matlack rookie or not rookie card, but TTM auto. How about a Trevor Story who's absolutely heating up like a furnace right now? Just an absolute bonfire of a bat. Trevor Story, Bowman's best blue refractor rookie card, numbered out of 250. Just a spectacular card, guys. It's got the sweet Rockies logo in the background. Absolutely insanity. Byron Buxton, Bowman's best rookie, came out of the gates like a bottle rocket. Don't know if he's hurt or not right now, but he's still killing it. Jacoby Jones, Topps Chrome, Negative Refractor, and the Chris Sale Bowman Platinum rookie card to round it out, guys. But that's going to do it for the video. Uh, he also sent a bunch of stuff that... Uh, he wanted to give away. He wanted me to give away. So I'm going to be giving away that Dansby Swanson. I don't know why this doesn't want to focus. 
There we go. But uh, you got the drift. So that's going to do it, guys. Really appreciate it. Let me know what you think in the comments below, and I will catch you all on the next one. Ped's Card Collection out. Take care.